Coordinator, I had the pleasure to recruit C.J. Avery. The first thing that I'll tell you about C.J. Avery is not only is he a great football player, but he's an even better human being. He's the type of kid who you look for in the recruiting process, not only to lead a position group, but to lead a defense and a team. And he's a kid who I know will help lead us to a national championship. <laughs> C.J. is six foot one. He's 210 pounds. He's a safety from Grenada High School in Grenada, Mississippi. Uh, CJ was an ESPN top 100 player in the country. He was a consensus four-star recruit, and he was also an Under Armour All-American. CJ is also one of four players that we currently have who are mid-year enrollees, so he's been here for about a month now. Uh, he's working in the weight room, doing a great job. So here's CJ. The one thing you know about CJ, I think the main thing that describes him is he's a ball hawk. Not only can he play in the middle of the field, but he can come up near the line of scrimmage and make plays in the opposing team's backfield. So on this play right here, CJ's coming off the edge. He's attacking the near, feet, near uh, shoulder of the quarterback right there. And then you like to see him wrap up, which he does a great job right here. He brings both arms. CJ Avery is a sound tackler. On this play, I'll give a little slogan real quick. There's a slogan that we use and it's pretty simple. It's either you're the hammer or you're the nail on every play. Uh, I'll let you guys be the judge of who the hammer and who the nail is on this play. I think CJ's the hammer. We'll, we'll, we'll go through that one more time. He does a great job right here. CJ's very physical. And once he sees something, he goes and he gets in attack mode. He's a very physical player. Finally, on this last play right here, offenses these days are liking to get the ball to playmakers in open space. On bubble screens, on quick screens, CJ is right here at the top of the screen. He does a great job diagnosing the play. He's got a very high football IQ. He re-diagnoses, sinks his hips right here. He's got a very, very powerful lower body, drives his hits, and has a knockback tackle. Everybody give it up for CJ. <laughs> the next guy we have here is Anthony Johnson. Anthony is a 6'1", 179-pound corner from Chaminade Madonna Prep in Coconut Creek, Florida. Uh, Anthony led his team to the state championship. He was an all-state performer. He's a three-star recruit, and he had 10 pass breakups this past season. Uh, Shaman Madonna, like I just said, is a very uh, prominent program in South Florida. He's very well coached. Not only can Anthony play the pass like most, most corners, but he also shows the willingness and toughness to play the run. Right here, he's up in the corner of the screen right here. He does a great job putting his face mask right here on the ball getting the ball out and causing a turnover for his team in the red zone. Another thing you see right here is offenses like to isolate some of their best players to the field. The offense right here puts three wide receivers down to the boundary and they leave Anthony on an island. Well, like Coach Petrino said, the main thing that we're looking for right now with defensive backs is length and athleticism. When you have the length and athleticism that Anthony has, you can put him on an island and feel confident. This offensive team runs a slant route right here. Anthony does a great job right here, opening up his hips with his change of direction, finding the ball. Coach Petrino talked about ball skills. He's got great ball skills, and he does a great job getting the ball out. Finally, like Coach said, we had 11 of our 22 signees come and join us uh, at, some, at some point this summer at some of our camps. So it really helps us as a coaching staff, you know, with our observations of what they're like as players, and not only as players, but how well can they learn? Anthony's a very smart player and he picked up our, our techniques and our crafts right away. He's up top right here. He does a great job focusing on the wide receiver's hips. He opens up his hips right here. He sinks his hips when the wide receiver starts chopping his steps to get out of his break. Anthony does a great job with his read, exploding, and then uh, makes the play on the ball. Everybody give it up for Anthony Johnson.